Greetings everyone, it is I, Kikoski here, welcoming you to the stream. The pre-stream to be exact, where you have the opportunity to get here, get comfortable and get ready for day 260 of Hillsfar. And a very surprised Graham, because we've already decided on the people for Hillsfar 10.0. If you have exclamation mark Hillsfar 10 typed into the chat, he knows his future is off Hillsfar and sings about it. He's like, I'm gonna leave. Quick, quick, I'm gonna leave. Totally gonna leave. See, we have... I have totally misspelled Hillsfar and I've put Hillsfat. Well, that's what I get for, uh... For doing typos. Let me change that. We, uh... We do not have the island of Hillsfat. Whoops. Wap, wap, wap. R and T are right next to each other, and I am a derp. Too late, it's in the VOD. Yes, but it will no longer be in any other requests. I mean, it's in the VOD. It's pretty much going to be there forever. Hills Fat is canon now. No, no, it is not. What happened yesterday? Well, I'll tell you what happened yesterday. Um, What happened yesterday is May 1st. And there is a very special tour that is a way of saying thanks to everyone. Up till May the 7th, you can get an airport ticket that allows you to go to that thing. June Vern is from Hills Fat. Oh dear. Hello, Alias. How goes it? I hope you're well. I hope you're all well. Also, look! We have, we have Snooty wearing the clothing that we've given her. Yay! Also, every I have a beer now. It is Bella doing some songs, singing songs, she's singing songs. Hello, Sonya. Yep, we have uh, Snooty. Snooty's going to get clothes today. Because Snooty's awesome. Oh, look how happy she is. Look how happy she is. All the Void Villagers in that one VOD hang out in the luxurious island called Hills Fat. Also, who wants adorable from Bella? The kind of urban she is. Oh, better. Also, lost item. A book. Guess whose book it was? Might have been the burbs. It might have been Judas's book. Yeah, this is a copy of the book. Well, it was, it was... It's a good thing I found it, then. I did take care of it. I sold it. But look at how happy Jitters was. That Daddy's a happy burb. Look, look at that happy burb. Daddy's such a happy burb. Also, little bit of snooty. Being a snooty. I hope your day isn't as busy as mine. Her, her day was super busy. She walked around, looked at trees. It was very, very, very busy. Also, we went to go see Graham. And guess what Graham had to say today, or yesterday. Um, I'll tell you what he had to say. He was ill. Oh no, Alias! You could always go get it. It's okay, I had medicine for him. Medicine! Oh, 
Yay! I don't want your shirt, but I will accept your thanks. Oh. Also, burb. And Fuchsia, who actually had a recipe that I didn't have. For gear apparatus. And Sid with his donut. Oh, hey, see, so I bought him my squid egg spaghetti. There's a line you never thought I'd say ever when I was streaming or playing a game. But here we are, in this world we live in, and I'm talking of now I want a donut. Well, I can't give you a donut. I'm sorry. I didn't buy any donuts when I went shopping today. I did buy bread, though. You can't have that either. And there's Boris. And Chapwick. And, oh, I caught it at just the right moment. Let's make today our best day ever. Mm. And also 58,000 bells for a TV. I, I'm trying to think about what I want to make the, uh, the thumbnail today. You know what? I might make it an entirely, like, a complete segue. I might make it, oh, hey, I see your eyeball in my squink kid spaghetti. I just want there to be, like, no context whatsoever to the thumbnail. People would be like, what? W what was it about the squid ink spaghetti? What's going on? W why? And I'm like, well, you know. Actually, I don't know. So, yeah, um, as I was saying before, before I got interrupted by my typo, we have the new villagers, Benjamin the Lazy, who originally was meant to be part of Hills 4 1.0, Bianca the Peppy, first tiger villager. Uh, Diva, who is a sisterly frog. Uh, Quilson, who was originally on Avataras and is absolutely amazing. And the villager that is completely and totally going to break my heart and soul. We, uh, we may have seen her last stream. She is going to break my heart and soul forever and ever and ever because she is so lovely and adorable and amazing. And then the wildcard villager. Whoever decides to leave first from 9.0 will open up the possibility... Celia's already here. I'm referring to the person who is going to eventually replace Celia. And will break my heart. D do I need to get... I'm going to have to get a picture of her, aren't I? Hang on. Oh, look! There's a picture of her. There's a picture of the, of the heartbreaker. There she is. With the little lollipop going hubbub. There she is. Look at her breaking hearts. And being lovely. Because she breaks hearts. By being lovely. There are multiple soul breakers. Yes, yes there are. But look, look, look. look. Oh, she's on a little bed. She's going like hubbub. And there she is looking at her little toe beans. And then there's her eating a little lolly. Oh, dog! Sorry. Gotta keep things cool and calm and composed, Kiko. They are small. They are so small. The smallest little toe beans. I have to watch out. Because if I'm not careful, she, she may stay forever. No dying before the stream begins, please. Only when the stream started right. Can't can't die until the stream has begun. Once the stream's begun, I may die at my leisure. Is that is that how that goes? Is that how that goes? Yes. Oh. I was expecting a no there. But but okay, glad we've got clarification. Okay, we are loading up. Will it be raining today? It could be. It's not a special event day, so it could rain. I hope it won't, but it could. And it is... No rain. Come on, no rain. No rain. No rain. Yay, no rain! Hey, I'm feeling all better now. Better sit over here and... Nah, I'm just not gonna sit there. I'm just gonna... Think about bubblegum KK. 
favorite song, you know? You'd never guess. Indeed. No worries, I have sport ball drink A and E for. I, I'm not sure we want that on speed dial. Raining on my island, and Barbara. Oh no! Get well soon, Barbara. Get well soon. I I don't know what made me pick Diva. I think it's because we haven't had a frog on the island for a while. I just went, you know what? I want a frog on the island, and so we're gonna have a sisterly froggo. Who's got the fitness hobby, I might add. Hello there, everyone! Right now on Hills Fire, it's 2pm on Saturday, April the 30th, 2022. It's another lovely Saturday, and KK is performing in the plaza. He loves audience requests, so if there's anything you'd like to hear, stop by the plaza and let him know. And with that, I'll get back to work supporting you and your enjoyment of our island. Thank you! Okay, let's, uh, let's go sort out our mail. Couple of things to go through. Also, we do have to change. Okay, what we got? Thanks, the other day. Here's the present I couldn't give you then. I was gonna pack it full of cookies, but then I ate them because I knew you'd want it the way that way, and I like to make you happy. Cookie Mouth Chapwick. It's a very, very Chapwick thing to do. Right. It was great of you to have me over the other day. I feel like seeing the way you've set your place up gave me lots of decorating ideas. I want to give you this gift as my way of saying thanks. Label that. Celia. Oh, she gave me a gift. A hand-picked gift. Luna gave me a thing of me. And he's talking about Mayday. We're gonna do that at some point today, probably. I got your letter! That was one- that was a lot of words. Reading it felt like running a marathon, but I'm really more of a sprinter, so I felt quite a sense of accomplishment when I crossed the letter's finish line. In it to win it, jitters. See? You can send letters! And Boris. Just walking around, thought of us. Right! Let's pop in, let's grab stuff. Now, if memory serves, we had a gift wrapped up for... Um, Graham that is definitely going to be giftable to him. Where is the gift for Graham? Oh, it's in my inventory, okay. Whew. Throw back Gothic Mirror, we can sell that. I think that was from Celia. That's Taylor's ticket. We don't really care about that. Babooshes. We're gonna get rid of them. And... Dream Bell Exchange ticket. Okay. Right. First things first. Gotta get Snooty's gift. And Sonya's gonna be like, is it a boot? And I'm gonna be like, no, Sonya. It is not a boot. And Sonya's gonna be like, but it has to be a boot! And I'm like, no boot. So. I think it's going to be this right here. Who, me? Y yeah. There's no winkle emote here. But what is the gift about? Well, you know, it's just a gift. Okay, we want to use black wrapping paper for everyone else, so that we don't mix things up. So, Edo period, um, or Edo period, uh, outfit. The red one is for Graham, and we want to wrap up... Mm, let's wrap up a bunch of pairs. Might as well. Everyone else gets pairs. You don't need to adjust to give... That is true. You don't need a justification. I just, you know, give gifts. Also, I got that pun. It's a good pun. Sonya definitely doesn't need a justification when the gift is boot. It is like, the gift is boot. And then, it is boot. Might wrap these up. I know I have picked the quietest room in the house to uh, wrap up gifts, and I apologize. The best thing is that it, it, yes, it is always the same boot. Like, Sonya had a dedicated gifting boot. It was this boot that was constantly gifted. Right, let's wrap up these. 
and that. And a little bit more, and then we have all of the gifts ready for everyone. There we go. Sorry I'm late, I was on my... That's no problem! You, you need not apologize for being late. You arrived at the time you ended up arriving at. I hope you and your mum had a good conversation. It was the soul boot. Oh no, that pun is terrible and I love it. I'm glad to hear it, Demon Dragon. Right. Let us go and uh, get changed into different clothing. Nobody has come to uh, say that they want to uh, pop in and chat. Though if they did, I could get a photo from them, like Audi did at one point, and just gave me a photo. Right, let's get out of what Label said was really good everyday clothing. Because this is, let's wear something different. Hmm. I think today... Yes. That is what we are going to wear. Hmm. Where is what I'm looking for? Yep. Mm hmm. Perfect. I just need a proper thing now on the back. Stop trusting Nable's fashion advice. Toy Day just keeps coming earlier and earlier. Yep, yep. I think, to be honest, Sandstar just went, okay, these are the only things that aren't washed. Th that aren't, um, sorry, that aren't dirty and are washed. So, uh, let's go and wear the one piece of clothing that I have. We're going to dress for Toy Day. I wonder if any villagers are going to remark that we are dressed for Toy Day. I am curious. I'm actually genuinely curious. Also, this is a reminder that many people who play this game will gift their villagers Toy Day clothing, and they will wear it all year. They don't care about the fact that uh, it's uh, the middle of, um, or late April. If it's a piece of clothing they've been given, they'll wear it. Oh, March is fishy. Oh, is that Boris? Is that Boris going to, no, 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 Boris, no. Gift for you. Hey, how you doing? Giving you a gift first. Um, you, have, you have something to give me? They'll be worried because Santa's digging up fossils. I mean, Santa's gotta dig up fossils. <laughs> Can't wait to see what's inside. <laughs> some peaches! It smells down good too. Gonna stop you from sitting down. I'll give you some real good home. In my belly. <laughs> <laughs> Let me thank you. A lattice wall. Enjoy! Thanks, Boris. I'll talk to you a bit later. Just wanted to stop you from sitting down. Has anyone else? So, oh, Celia. Oh, I was too late to stop Celia from sitting down. Darn it! This is okay. Celia sat down. We're gonna have to wait until half past now to go and give her a gift. It'll be fine. So I hope you're all doing well today. I hope uh, everything is going fine. Maybe we'll get some photos today. We haven't had many photos from 9.0. Or any photos from 9.0. It's when Celia's like, best way, way to stop him from, uh... They are very fast. They are the fastest villagers in the game. By far. Like, fastest villagers in the game. By far. Oh, there goes the shovel. I wonder if people are going to like look at what I'm wearing if they just randomly turn up the stream and go, what, 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 what is, what is he doing? It's like, I'm wearing Santa clothing. That's what I'm doing. It's 
not warm enough yet that my character would literally be boiling in that jumper. Give it a few months. Oh! Graham's checking out... Graham's checking out... The flower! Look at him! He's like, this is a really weird flower indeed. Oh, I do like the education hobby villagers. They are wonderful. And now we have a gift for him because we got lots of friendship points for giving him uh, that medicine. What's up, Sandstar? Got a gift for you. Oh, for real? Yes, I do. Would you like this right here? What a fun surprise. I'll open this right now. Do my eyes to see me, or is this a gingham picnic shirt? This is the kind of gift I've got to try on right away. Oh, look at him! Hey, not bad. Really not bad at all. Dare I say, good? Also, his songs come on. Alright, you got my attention. What's up, indeed? I want to chat. And everything can be high fashion like metallic pants or literally three beach towels sewn together. Sometimes you need a few basic pieces for everyday wear. Like my Ginnum Picnic uh, shirt here. Also... Every day I like these switch out my landscape. It's, 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 it's... I... I can only apologize. Uh, well, actually, I, I don't know why I'm apologizing. I didn't design Twitter's that thingy, but... Uh, I, of course... Oh, well, someone's having a dance. Someone's having an enjoyable dance. Oh! Hang on. Got, got, a, got to replicate a, like, a album cover or something. There we go. It's a 2D, and it's a stand- Oh! That's a picture! Oh, We're both being very silly, 2D. Yes, yes we are. But that's just what Hillsfar's like. Marty has album? I don't know. Look at her with a pink um, fishing rod I gave her. Good afternoon, 2D. Got a gift for you. You want to give me something? That I do. Would you like fruit? Mind if I open this up right now? Oh, this is great. It's some peaches. Thanks. That's a thoughtful of you. I have something here for you. A Parker undercoat. Thanks, Margie. No problem, Tootie. Could be a new uh, thumbnail picture. What's up, Tootie? I just want to chat. Our weekend's great. The only downside is that time goes by faster when you're having fun, so weekends fly by, Tootie. Gotta shoot down the thingy. Where is it? Okay, wind's not very strong today, so, uh... Fun fact, if the wind is stronger, presents will blow by faster. It's just something that you don't think about, but it's something that happens. Stronger wind means faster presents moving. Also, what's in the present? A cordless phone. Hey, buddy. Hey, it's Sandstar. Always a pleasure. It totally is. Um, you giving me something? As in, it's totally a pleasure for me to see you. And here's a gift. Hey, hey, what what it is? I'm excited to open it. Some peaches! Must smells down good too. I'll give me some real good home. In my belly. Ga ha 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 ha! I don't want any freebies. Here, take it, have a tape deck. I mean, I'm ancient, so here's an ancient thing. Something up, I just wanna chat. Hey there, Sandstar. Ain't I looking sharp in my school uniform and necktie? Take guts and swagger to pull off a bold look like this. Ga ha 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 ha. Totally does. Oh, so I need to take a picture of Margie. Oh! 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 Jitters! Jitters! Look at him go with his perfectly ordinary beak! Totally ordinary beak. Mm -hmm. 
Look at him groove! And this is why I put a tape deck in his, uh, in his garden. So he can groove! Goal! I like those threads. Hey, buddy. What? What he was in? Totally ordinary. No, that was specific. Exactly. Perfectly ordinary burb. What's inside? Some beach sun lizards right about now. He is a perfectly ordinary burb. Thanks. I'll leave this later. Here's something for you. Some mariachi clothing. Take it on me, shy. Thanks, jitters. No problem, Bizzard. Yo, what's up, Bizzard? Just got a chat. Hey, do you know the most important necessity of wilderness survival? It's your biceps. If you want to survive out in the wild, you gotta have huge biceps. Out in the wild, you gotta carry a lot of heavy things and maybe swim in rough waters, right? You gotta have faith in your own arms. In other words, your arm muscles are the most important for survival. He changes what's important for survival. On a regular basis. Oh. If I was warm and sat down here, another sign that spring has arrived. Oh. Watch her just fall asleep now and just be like, and then she just snoozes away. No, oh. it's like there's too much. Oh no! I I didn't mean it. No! And bet. Two D down. No. She is a slap. I was like, she's gonna fall asleep, right? And then I was like, I was kidding, game! I was kidding! <laughs> it's nice to take a break outside, even if I didn't fall asleep just now. <laughs> spring tootie, as in, not toy day! Well, you know, spring's moderately close to toy day. It's closer than summer is. Okay, Graham is over by Bella's house. We don't know where Bella is. Also, did I hit the rock near Sid? I don't think I did. I'm gonna go hit that rock. Also, I see the game is tempting me with yet another present. Alright, game. I'll play your game. I didn't think that phrase through, did I? No, no, I didn't. No. I ended up repeating the same word. That was smooth. Ins inspection equipment? I'm keeping that. <laughs> that is an item I'm keeping. You're just gonna dance, I said. Nope, he's going back over there. Okay, over here we go. We have a villager to find. Actually, we have several villagers to find. Maybe put that in front of the airport. Nah, I'm sure it'll be fine. Hey, Birdman, how goes it? I hope you are well. You've already missed a, uh, a uh, singing solo from Jeddah's. Which villagers will be allowed in hills? I don't know. I mean, I don't have a third island, and I have zero plans to have a third island. You did miss a sleeping Margie. Yup. Yup. There was a sleeping Tootie. She was very asleep. We woke her up, though. I was like, don't fall asleep, Margie. Margie falls asleep. It's like, ah. The game knew. Also, here's a fossil. And Celia is at KK Slider's concert. There's our inventory. It's still got space. We still have some leeway. Okay, Chapwick is out somewhere. Margie is gone. 
She's like, after falling asleep, I think I'll go back home. And then she just falls asleep at home. Could happen. Right, we have another fossil that needs putting here. This is that. Having fun. What about Chadwick? He's not here. He's not here either. Hmm. So we don't know where Bella is. And we don't I have not had any of those kind of things for so long. I'm just one of those when I'm up, I'm up kind of people. I don't go have naps. Oh, oh, there he is, and he is looking amazing. And he's off! C come back! Come back, I want to take a picture. Oh, here we go. That's a good picture. Bye! <laughs> yeah, he, and he's off! Yay, Sunstar! I was just thinking about how I wanted to see you! I got a gift for you. Oh, what are you giving me? I'm giving you some... fruit! I wonder what's inside! I'm gonna open it! Some peaches! Yummy! It looks so good! Thank you, thank you, thank you! Oh, Sunstar! I'm letting the floor and eat that! I might even share with the bugs! Here, yeah, man! It's a pop-up toaster! Enjoy, Blurg! I make toast with it! Give me something up, I haven't been paying attention! I just want to chat! Tomorrow's the day the folks in the Happy Home Academy come to visit. The bikes on the floor always get excited when the Happy Home Academy comes by. I wonder what score I'll get. I'm so sleepy. Anyway, what's going on with you? I just want to chat. Hey, what if we hung out at your place for a change, Blurg? Uh... Sure! Yay! When should I head over? Right now! I can't wait to see what your place is like! I'm so excited! Off we go to Sensai's house! Yay, Blurg! Oh! My heart! My heart! I didn't expect him to do a little spin! Be great for Chadwick. Oh, here he is, the little penguin. Oh yeah! Before I forget, I want you something. I hope you like it. Food. This is your style, right? It's a peach. Wait, I gave you three peaches. Yeah, I'm giving you one back. It's my peach, though, not your peach. I challenge you to a game of wit, Sunstar. <laughs> I won't lose. Time for the funnest game I know. It's called High Card Low Card. If you get it right, you're gonna win my fleece PJs. Let's get started. So, I'm gonna just draw one random card first. Alright, it's the eight. Now, I'll draw the next card. I got the next card ready. So, is the number on this card higher or lower than 8? Think about it, but not too hard, <laughs> I think it's lower. And the answer is... Oh, wow, this is your tense, huh? I usually try to be more chill. Anyway, the answer is... It's 5! You got it! Alright, as promised, here's your fleece, PJs. That was fun, <laughs> You should play again sometime. Right, Blurg? Right, buddy. What am I doing here? Can, can I go check your fridge? I'm hungry. What are you doing with the recent Cyrus photo, photo plate in here? <laughs> Is there gonna be a wedding with dancing and music and cake? He wants the cake. This place is so chill. I could just chill here and be chill. Yes! That is what chilling is, Chapwick. Being chill. Do you know where Bella is? Nope! Darn it. 
w w where you going, buddy? You can't go into that room. I know what he's gonna do. He's gonna find the floor. No, nope, he's not. I thought he was gonna... Hmm. What are you gonna do, buddy? Sensei, you got a really great place. You, uh, you mind if I crash here for a while? Just a couple weeks. You barely know the same here. Ah, I'm joking. Just pulling your leg. It is really nice house, though. Oh. I gave him that shirt. <laughs> roommate Chapwick. No. Chapwick has his own house. I'm not having a roomie with Chapwick. Normally, a villager has decided to, like, sit down at this point. Not Chabwick. Yeah. I mean, he's got his own house. And then he turned it off. Are you gonna dance? Oh, there he goes! <laughs> My butt's gonna go right here. Sit! Well, as luck would have it. Time to sit. Oh, look at me and Chapwick. He is a buddy. I want to see the other rooms too. Yeah, unfortunately, Chapwick, I do need to go and give gifts to other people. I think your house is real cozy and comfortable, and he smells just like you. Yes. Yes, it does. Now, buddy, I'm sorry. But I do have to go and do stuff. Sensta? Going somewhere, Blurg? Yeah? Okay, I should go home then. This was super fun, Sensta. Quest complete! That is counted as a quest. Now we can go and check the other areas. And also maybe see if there's anyone. Well, for all I know, Bella could be in the. Uh, Ah, I see that, that uh, Graham has moved on to my plants. He's now looking at my flowers. Oh, no, no, he, he, he will go, I mean. Now Graham wants to come inside. No, I don't think he does. I think he's good. Margie is still there. You're still there. Fuchsia is out. Some well, Chabwick's there now. Chabwick's gonna see that butterfly. No, Chabwick, there's a butterfly like right there. Chabwick, you are not good at this catching. Butterflies thing. Nope. He is, however, good at planting his butt on the ground. A fine skill. And nope. Okay, no Boris either. Where are all the villagers? They are playing elusive today. Graham needs to be given a crown to wear. I mean, I don't think I'm going to be giving him a crown. I don't really think it goes with his general aesthetic. I am giving him a fedora, though. Also, oh yeah, skateboard wall rack acquired. Now we can be the cool kid. Well, if he wants to catch lunch, he could just go check his fridge. Or the ice cream parlor that's outside his house. 
I really want ice cream. I have tons of chocolate and all kinds of things, but I want ice cream. Like, there was a reduced to clear little mini cake in, um... In a supermarket uh, nearby yesterday, and I have had was it yesterday? The day before yesterday, actually, and I have had great fun slowly eating that tiny cake. It was a very delicious cake. It had salted caramel icing on it, and I have to say, salted caramel is one of my favorite, favorite flavors. I love salted caramel. Also, I want that bug. You fool. You have flown right into my trap. It's not much of a trap, really. Okay, I want to drop this and... Go over here and sell some things. Alright, what we got? Well, speak of skateboards, there's a skateboard! I mean, if I want to craft a skateboard rack, I need three skateboards. Well, one, I buy three skateboards and craft a rack. So that we can pretend to be cool. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're approaching me? It's like, yes. Yes, indeed. Right. I'm gonna buy some skateboards. One. Two. And three. But I'm not gonna craft it yet. This is on the very off chance that we end up getting a craft a skateboard rack for the villager that is going to be coming to the campsite today. Actually, wh why hesitate? We can always just buy more skateboards. That's just me being silly. Also, there are 33 of you here. Thank you so, so very much for being here. It's awesome to have you all here. Also, I'm now going to hit some trees with an axe. I need some hardwood. All right. That is one piece of hardwood. I just need one more. And there we go. 90 Sandstar hopes to be cool skateboarding around the island. Why hesitate? We could always buy more skateboards, and now that is a quote forever. Darn it, I should have said blue cavalier hat. Nah, nah, we're going with a fedora. We are giving him a fedora, like I gave Roscoe a fedora, and he is going to rock it. He is going to be the most trendy of all the villagers on Avatars and Hillsfar combined. We shall all see Graham and despair, for we can never match the heights of his fashion. Oh! Sonya's going to be happy, because Snooty's in. Snooty! Let's go say hi to Snooty, and give Snooty a gift. Oh, Snooty's cooking. Sorry, did you say something? I'm entirely focused on the culinary arts at the moment. Well, what are you making? Oh, I'm glad you asked. I'm making some seafood at Gilo. It's quite trivial if you have the recipe, Sniff. How silly of me. I could just offer you the recipe. Now, if you already know the recipe, you can feel free to share it with someone else. Just tell them you got it from me, won't you? You can use that to cook, yes. Also, have you liked what I've done to uh, Snooty's house, Sonya? Do you like it? I added little things, like that little shelf there, and the candle, and this, and a speaker, and this, this, the, the light, and the rug. No boots, though. 
Why, is this something I can help you with, Sniff? I've got a gift for you. For me? You shouldn't have. I insist. Would you like... this? Well, 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 what could it be? I must be dreaming. This can't be an Edo period merchant outfit. I never do this, but I'm gonna put this on right now. Oh, it's exactly what I've been looking for. Thank you. Hey, some of the villager houses are really well put together. How can I thank you? Uh, why don't you take this reward of a rugby uniform? I didn't have to add that much to it. Oh my, what is it, Sniff? I just want to chat. When my creative juices are running dry, it's rare and happen but happens. I like to teach myself a new skill. At the moment, I'm pursuing my dream of woodworking. My last piece was a very chic anteater figurine. I'll show it to you, but I was working from a mirror, and I dare say I captured my own likeness to a T. So I burnt it to cinders. There's only room for one snooty in this world, Sniff. Not ominous at all! I remember when Kitty said that to me. I could see her grin. Staring into my soul. Also, no one has commented on the fact that I'm wearing Christmas stuff. Or should I say Toy Day stuff? Could be. <gasps> Fuchsia! Oh dear, what's this movie so fast to me? Lovely by Claw. Fuchsia! Hey, Senstar! What are you here to see, Precious? I'm here to give you a gift. Seriously? You rock! What do you got? I've got this gift right here. One of the villagers that we've not been able to see yet. You don't mind if I open this now, right? Not at all. There's no one takes in the beaches. Thanks! Thanks, I can use for days. They're scary good, Precious. It's a wise gift exchange. Here, take fi- Oh, no! More Precious, someone's been chatting. No, Fuchsia, why? I'm not really the trendy type, but I wouldn't complain if something I got here caught on, Precious. We got a- we got a photo! I gotta- I gotta- gotta take a photo with her. This is gonna be tricky, cause- cause- no! It's gonna be so tricky with you in here! Okay, come on. There we go! We got a double picture there! One down, five more to go. Oh no! Sansa, I just wanted to say thank you for always being there to help Label. She talks about you all the time, you know. She says the outfits you pick are always super inspiring. And then she runs back here and starts sketching furiously. It's wonderful to see. You've done so much for all three of us. Thank you from the root of my quills. Oh no, this means... This means that if Fuchsia asks to leave, I have to say yes. If she asks to go... How come nobody wants to take a picture with me? Well, fine. We will take a picture with you. I just need to get you behind me. We will take a picture with Sable. That's why. Because she ignores them. His his phone? Oh, no! Thanks, Sonya. Did you figure go ahead? I mean, you really should take off that hat. So, it begins. It begins. Hold on, don't be caught your eye. I just want to see how many heart aprons I have. I am very worried. It begins. Also, there is still a villager that we have that could potentially give us... Okay, we pretty much have all of them. That could give us their photo, and that's Celia. Celia is currently watching KK's concert. Thanks, please come again. I will. The beginning of the end, and we've only just got Graham. Like, he's only got his first piece of clothing. And already one of the 9.0 villagers is leaving. Already one of the 9.0 villagers is leaving. Okay, not yet. We still have to wait for Fuchsia to ask to go. Or for somebody else to get their photo, to give their photo to us, and them to ask to go. We're basically waiting for a villager to go that has their photo. That we had the photo of. 
words. There we go. Just get rid of that one. It was inevitably going to happen at some point. It was just a question of who. I did not think it would be Fuchsia. I did not think it would be Fuchsia. She saw what you gave Graham. W what? What's wrong with what I gave Graham? Hmm? What's wrong with it? The answer is nothing. There's nothing wrong with what I gave Graham. What I gave Graham is amazing. I gave him exactly what he likes. Something that's green. Silvana sent a letter to Fuchsia. It's like, hop up, I want to move on the island so that I can slay Kiko once and for all. Please, give him your photo. It is time to enact ca uh, to enact the, uh, the uh, conniving plan of Operation Maul. Kitty's ultimate revenge. Getting me on the island so that I will slay Kiko. And then Kiko is slain. Rip Kiko. This way, but this way, but this way, but this way, that way, that way, that way, this way, and that away. We can actually. Do we have room? I think we can grab all of these. But yeah, absolutely, unequivocally slain. I haven't even shown you who I'm going to invite in today in the campsite. Because we are going to invite someone via the uh, amiibos. I do have basically half of the villagers I want to uh, add in. Two of the villagers I don't have the amiibo of. I don't have the amiibos for Diva or Bianca. i am uh, got those on order. They will arrive shortly. Is it Stinky? No, we've already... Tiny, we've, we've already had Stinky. We, we, we are not having Stinky again. I want to be careful, otherwise, like, the, the ultimate version of Hills Far is going to have Sylvana, and I'm just going to die. I don't know if I can take, like, having Sylvana and Margie. I don't know if I could. It would probably kill me. They are both so adorable, and I want to try and make sure that, like, this island doesn't have the same mixture of villagers that the, uh that Avataris does, because Avataris has two normals. Flurry and Maple. And let's be honest, I I, I can never say bye to Flurry, and uh, I would not want to say bye to Maple, because not only is Maple adorable, but, you know, Maple came from Cabania. And then they talk to each other in front of you, and I'm like, well, this is me dead. Just dies immediately. Rip, Kiko. Just ultimate rip. Also, you look at Sylvana. Can you believe Sylvana is tier 4? Okay, she's high tier 4, but she's still tier 4. This is madness. Who looks at that little squirrel and her going hubbub and goes, no, this villager is not number one. And I'm like, but why? How? Exactly. She is so small and she so cute. And she goes hubbub. Oh, is that another present? I don't actually have space for that present right now. You don't understand Margie being low tier? Um, may I present to you the villager Tia? Tia is a much higher villager in uh, tiers, and many people, when I've spoken about Margie, go, oh, like the, the budget tier, and I'm like, no! Not budget tier! No! People go, Margie is budget tier! And then I zoom in. And I'm like, ready? Oh. oh dear, pardon me. Why, hello, Sandstar. Welcome to the Hills Farm Museum. How may I be of service? I want to, uh, assess some fossils. Oh, what would you like me to assess? I'm all a flutter. We have all these four here. So we need to find Bella in here. 
Oh, more than one I see. Let us take a closer look, shall we? Yes, indeed, they're quite splendid. But alas, our museum already has fossils such as these. I'm indeed tempted to purchase these in my personal collection. But no, I must exercise restraint. I'm return them to you now. Might I help you with anything else? Nope, I'm good. Charlie good. Please enjoy the rest of your visit. Don't mind me, I'm just uh getting myself a glass of orange squash. And getting these dog miles. I need to buy more items. Hmm. I can maybe buy something at some point. Probably some wrapping paper. I should buy some wrapping paper. There's an eeks! Hey, Sandy! What a quickie dick running into you here! Hello. Here I am, an up and coming pop star surrounded by gobs of stylish art and other cool cultural stuff. Are you like thinking what I'm thinking? I'm thinking someone should totes take my pick and put it on the cover of my fave new magazine. It's called The Sophisticated Mouse and it is so me, eeks! It is so you. Sandy, you need something, eeks? I want to give you a gift. Yes! It is for you! Would you like this? It, it's some fruit. What is it? What is it? What is it? I'm ripping off now. Okay, let me see. Some peaches. Yum! I'm winning so fast, it's gonna be rude! Thanks a bunch. Here, I'll trade you. It's a sepia puzzle wall, and he loved those. Thanks, Bella. We gonna go look at art now. We get toys to look at art. Look at me in art! I'm looking at art! Shall we go? Breathe, Kiko! I'm breathing! I told Stigo everyone in the campaigning is full on relaxing. Self care is so important, right? Look, I know I have a reputation of being an on the go celeb in the making, but even I make sure to have a full on chill sesh now and again. What, for real? You were the one who bought this piece of art to the Museum Eeks? Wells, that is fantastic! No, you are fantastic! Love, love, love! That is an Eeks. She's looking at art. Being an art. And now we go to see Brewster. Hey, buddy. Was hoping I'd see you today. Care for some coffee? Mine's two hundred dollars a cup. Sure thing. If I recall, you said you like your coffee on the cooler side. Does that sound about right? You want your coffee at a lower temperature? Yes. If that's how you want it, I'll make yours at a lower temperature. Just, just keep making it at a lower temperature, Brewster. Don't ever stop making it at a lower temperature. In fact, as I always say. Just give me some soft drinks. Makes me happy. I made this so that even the most sensitive of mouths could drink it without delay. Here you are. 200 bells. That is also the temperature of the coffee. 200 bells. I don't know what the bell measurement of temperature is, but there we go. Cool down a little. Could be cold and not coffee. Nah, I, I just want not coffee or tea. I don't like either. I have not found a coffee or a tea I like. I'm just like, give me give me a soft drink. Or a squash. For orange juice. I will take any of those options. They are all fine options. Sandstar, how are you, Feathers? I just want to chat. I'm about midway through simple, eco-friendly luxury. It's such a great book! How can I help you, Feathers? I just want to chat. I've been trying to learn magic tricks. I asked Margie to help me practice. I was going to have her pick a card, any card, and then I would guess what she picked. But before I could, she said she'd give me a big gift if I got it right. I mean, that wasn't the point. I felt so awkward, so I chose the wrong card on purpose. What else could I have done, Feathers? Aww. 
200 bells are 75 tambourines. That, that also doesn't help me. Also, we are doing well on time, actually. Doing surprisingly well on time. Okay. So, gotta sell some things. I realize I put away my, um, the hardwood. This is all right. Keep. Oh, no, no. Don't sell Fuchsia's photo. Oh. I was like, don't sell Fuchsia's photo. Oh, that would have been such a bad decision. I'd have had to have gone to Nookerson to get another one. Oh, that would have been embarrassing. I'd have been like, hey, this is when Kika goes to Nookerson to get another photo because he's stupid. Would you rather sell? Yes, I would absolutely rather sell another Mona Lisa than Fuchsia's photo. Absolutely. There's like no deliberation there. I absolutely would do that. Also, selling items. I need to get, um... Yep. Meow. Into here. Because we have somebody to say hi to in a moment. Yes, 200 Kelvin is very cold. And here's our Nook Mile allocation. And here is my 100,000 bells to go with the other 23.15 million. No, I no, I would literally just buy another one from Nookism. Like, I've already earned it. That was just me being silly. I would not have her stay for that. That would, that, well, would just be not sensible of me. But you know what is happening? We're going to say hi to Benjamin. He was originally on the plan for Hills for 1.0. And then we met Cousteau and it all went terribly wrong. So I'm, I'm going to uh, right this wrong. Hi, it's Benjamin. What's up? Hi, by the way. I was so excited when I answered, I forgot I said it. I know lots of ways to say hi, so I'll call the right guy for a greeting. Let's see. Hola, salut, ciao, and ni hao, alan, guten tag, inyong, konnichiwa, something else, salutation, namaste, shikamu, and um, hi. So, what's the deal? Did you just call just to say hello, or is there something else? You invited me to go camping in your island? That sounds real fun. Did you see those eyes? Those red pupilless eyes. Oh, I'm gonna have fun with this uh, villager. This villager is amazing. He's so distinct and so adorable. I like him. Let's go say hi. Let's go say hi to Benjamin. He's got the nature hobby, so he likes bugs. He's gonna come in and see us wearing this clothing and go, Wait, is it toy day? Have I been here that long? Oh no! Oh, he's got a donut! Oh my, I just heard his theme. That is the best theme in the world. Thanks, Nicole. I'm real happy you invited me already. Did you hear how, like, Discord and that was Ben just think great. It's a real easy one that you pull right out your pocket and pop right up. The hard part's when I gotta go home. It's your hard to fold up. I don't think I can do it alone already. Oh look how sad he is Man, I've been really wanting this easily made this island like a stone table. I have to just show you this up close. I love this villager already. Look at him. He's wonderful. We can make that for you, buddy. Yeah, you do that for me? Me? I'm glad my brain told me that idea. I can't wait to see it. What's wrong with his face? There's nothing wrong with his face. When I gotta see it today, though, because I'm going home tomorrow. There's nothing wrong with his face. He's just got red eyes. Alright, so. Stone table. That is a stone recipe. It only takes stone. And it takes eight of them. He's also got the donut. 
Oh, I like him. Also, I think his house is like a schoolhouse interior. Off we zoom! Zooming along at the speed of Sandstar. Making a thing because we have to. Otherwise, we won't have Benjamin. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Zoom, zoom. There's Chadwick. Who replaced Benjamin on Hills Far? Uh, Cousteau did. Like, I had to swap everything round. Trying to figure out if he's a reference to another character? Probably not. I mean, he's just called Benjamin. He's just a dog called Benjamin. Not everything is a reference in the end. Sometimes it's just a name. Right, first things first. Um, skateboard wall rack. Radical man, you made a thing. Now I need to make that table. No, I think he's just called Benjamin. Like, I don't think he's a reference to anything. I think he's just a dog called Benjamin. I could look it up, but I don't think he's a reference. I'm gonna look it up. Let's see if he is a reference to anything. It could be a reference, but there's no actual confirmation. Like, it could also just be a dog called Benjamin. So really, there's not a huge amount pointing towards anything. It's just like, well, there's a dog and it's called Benjamin. Also, we have one more customization kit. We need to buy more of them. <laughs> Thanks, Anya. I know exactly what color I want to make Fuchsia's photo. That. Ah. We get to put it on the wall. We also get to give her a, um, the flower. Need to do that too. I really like her photo. And there it is. Here we go. Yeah. This is a photo of future. Huh? There's a message written in small letters on the back of the photograph. Born September 19th, Virgo. Favorite saying is, it takes one to know one. Oh. Now I need to go give her a uh, golden flower. And then tomorrow she's like, I want to leave. And I'm like, no! And it all goes wrong. And then we go villager hunting. And we find Sylvana. And I'm like, no! I don't need you right now. I need you later. And then she'll be like, too late, hop up. You're going to invite me now. And I'm like, no! I totally would too. I am weak. It would happen. All right, get that gold rose. Hi, Jitters. Sometimes I wonder if the villagers think about me just... I mean, I know they don't, because they're not programmed to. But imagine if it's like a real thing, and they're like... He just walks around, he runs around all the time. Just sorting out everything. 
super quick. Also, it is now three. So we have an hour to do everything else on the art. <gasps> he found a flower. Hey, Chadwick. He ignored. And... Here we go! Yeah! Just gotta wait for this cloud to go! Yeah! Perfect. Right, one more thing for us to do, and that is we need to... Oh! Hey, I'm being adorable! Yes, you are. This is super comfy, Berg! Oh. oh, he watered the plants. And now... Giving Benjamin his gift. Because he's adorable and he deserves it. Hey, buddy. Oh, that theme! You look real happy. Did you make that thing we talked about? I totally did. You know it, buddy. Have the stone table. When I hear a story, I'll tell you a story. The story goes like this. One day someone from Hillsborough thought, Stone table! And then they ran to the away bench and made that thought to a thing. I don't know if that story is true, but man, it's inspiring. Let me give you my rotten armchair as a thank you. Don't know why I brought it with me. Thanks for the real great souvenir. I love this island so much, I hope you invite me again. I totally will, buddy. Camping food is all about s'mores, chocolate cream crackers, and a toasty marshmallow. Man, I wish I could eat s'mores at home. Too bad there's no way to toast a marshmallow without fire. You heard it here first, folks. There is no way to make a marshmallow without fire. None. You need a campfire. There are literally no other sources of marshmallows. Ever. Your know, island's cozy, everybody's nice, they smell good, and they feed me stuff. Man, I could stay here forever. Well, why not live here? Haha, <laughs> that sounds cool. Invite me again sometime. And that's Benjamin! I did not mean to do that. A nice picture of Benjamin. Nope, not that picture. Give me a better one. That's a good picture. Now, it's time to do something that I have not at all prepped for. And that is... Sandstar dreams of the day he is the campsite villager. Nah! I'll tell you what, one day, maybe one day in the future, there will be a, right, we're going to make our permanence now, and we're going to sit down, and we're going to think about which ten villagers we actually want on the island forever. Oh! We just keep running into each other today, Tootie. Oh! I was reading a whodunit novel from a library when I found a note sandwiched between the pages. I read the note and was shocked. It was the name of a suspect in my novel. Was he the one who did it? I felt so bitter about the whole thing. So I wrote my own name and stuck it in the book instead, Tootie. Yo. Oh. Look at Marty! It's been cut! Walk back over here. Oh. Okay. Oh, enough being distracted. There is something important we need to do, and that is, we need to go over here. We have a grand de debate. A moment. We can't have six kitties. Hey, hey, we you want to get away the skies, the Hillsville Airport. Oh, it's you! Good timing! I got a Mayday ticket here from Tom Knot with Sandstar written on it, which makes it yours. So it's only good for a limited time, so when you want to use it, say the magic words, I want to fly, got it? So, Sandstar, you got anything to tell me? I do, I want to fly. 
Roger! So, just to get the paperwork official, where do you want to go? I want to use my Mayday ticket! You ready to go on a Mayday tour? Roger that! This Mayday tour is a special trip to a faraway island. It's all organized by Tom Nook. As for what awaits you there, you'll just have to find out when you land. For this tour, you have to go empty-handed. We'll hold on to all your belongings here at the counter. Don't worry, we'll be sure to return them when you get back. So, want to start your luggage and head down the Mayday tour? I do! Alright, let's get you airborne! Time for us to solve a mystery, everyone! We need to solve a mystery! Dodo Wimes, Dodo Ta, will be a copy, got a rock its wings, over! I do not know how to solve this, by the way. This could be a new puzzle. Okay, have a good flight, friend! And when you need to travel, just think what would Dodos do? Watch me get this wrong! Hey, if I get it right, though... I can then do it on Avataras, which I probably will have to bestream. And we have touched down. You are on you're at a mate your mayday tour destination. Now this tour is different than most. The whole island's a giant maze. Nothing but an aerial view wouldn't help, but that's not why we're here. This is a navigation tour. You copy? The point is to find your way through. We stowed your gear back at the airport counter, so you'll start this mission with empty wings, or hands. We big shot bird types rely on our inner radar to get us around, it's a pretty nifty trick. But you ground-bound goslings will have to zero in on whatever you can find in the maze to reach your target. If you get stuck or grounded or lost in a fog bank or whatever, just hail the rescue service on your phone. All whiskered allies will reset things, you can refuel, regroup and restart the maze. And if you ever feel like you need a little extra intel, I might give you a hint or two. So, time to get going, right about November Oscar Whisker. Good luck and wheels up! Okay! We have a shovel. Hmm. Right. Well, this. Okay, let's do that. I think they want us to eat the fruit and pick up the tree. Mm -hmm. What can I grab right now? Okay, I can grab... Well, there's our target! There's our target! Okay, I can get... Mm, not there... Get a stick... Another stick... Another stick... A stick... I'm missing a stick. Down here... is a worn axe! Hmm. Okay... Iron... What I need right now is that bit of fruit. Leads me back to here, so okay. That leads you back to here. I'm missing a stick. I have a worn axe. The worn axe gives me access to fruit, and I can use one of those fruits to get over here.
Yeah, there is, but I can't get it right now. I could if I use this to chop down this. Okay. So, now I can grab these fruits. And eat a fruit. Um, 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 um. Yeah, do that. Hello! How goes it? Flimsy axe. Axe. I'm gonna need access to this eventually. As a coffee, trying to stave off sleep? Eh. I mean, if you need to sleep, sleep's important. Mostly because it just took one hour nap. Ah, fair enough. Okay, so I have one more fruit here. So let me get into here. So now I have enough of that. Now I need to get to there. Ah, fair enough. From there. Okay, okay. I know what I'm doing now. I have one more piece, or two more pieces of fruit. The way I found to reduce caffeine intake was to do it gradually. I am not doing this well. I'm really not doing this well. Oh no, wait, here we go. I, I, I just, like... Depends on how you get your caffeine, of course. There we go! Right, now we have this. Now I have access to a... really good way... of getting, um... through all these trees. And it's called this, uh, place here. We craft a a little axe, and then we craft a bigger axe. Yeah, this I think is the same one as the first puzzle, so uh, it all kind of came back to me quite quickly. Now we have this really good axe, we can just chop through everything. So I like that the game gives you the flimsy axe and the axe recipes, just in case you need them. So I need to get over there now. Which should be easy to do. Going that way. Around here. And through. That's one. Grab this. I have two of these now. So, shop through that. Chop through this one. Jump through this one. We're not done yet. 
there are secrets to uncover. It's a very lovely game. It is my Zen Garden game, as it were. It's very adorable. And relaxing. The game doesn't think to point this out. You can go all the way around. I only have two pieces of fruit, though. So I don't think I can get these ones. I think I foolishly ate a piece of fruit I didn't need to. I... To be fair, I never said that I was concerned about other people enjoying it. I have a uh, group of people that enjoy watching me play this. And it's a nice relaxing game. Also, it's time to have a conversation with everyone's favorite NPC. Hey you, wow, what are the chances we meet like this again? Congrats on making it to the end, by the way. It's been a while, hasn't it? How have you been doing? Um, uh, been doing great. I'm really glad to hear that. It makes you think we'll both still be smiling next time we run into each other. That we will, buddy. Wouldn't that be great? Hey, I think I'm gonna write you a letter later. It's always fun to keep in touch. I hope our paths cross again. I'll be seeing you around. That's not Flick. No, it's, it's, it's Rover. You know, I think I'll hang out in this island a little longer. I like it here. Tom Nook has really made a name for himself. It's not bad for a guy who used to loan a little more than an apron. Hey, you, person that I totally recognize. It does seem to be about making friends. Yes, it is. It's very much about making friends and just relaxing and chilling out and I want to get a nice picture with him. Rover. Rover, buddy. Because he roves. He travels around a lot. That is why he's called Rover. like you want it, by the way. If you want to restart, you can do so by using the Rescue Services app on your Nook phone. Eh, I think I did. It's nice to take a plane every once in a while. I used to traveling by train. Riding the rails, as they say. You know, I think I'll hang on to this app. Oh, he is lovely. And you can't have him on your island. You've never been able to have him on your island. He's just... He's Rover. Lovely cat. Right, we're pretty much done. So... With us being done. We can dig these up. Couldn't go this way without finishing the maze because of the hole here. And we didn't get all of the bell vouchers, but we got some of them. And that's all that matters. I don't really care about getting all of them. For the love of Nook's ever flying potpourri jar, did you saw through the entire maze, Sandstar? I did. Way to saw through. You'll have to let old Nook know. One dilly of a mayday tour, huh? Squawk the word, we'll bring you back home to the home hangar. Oh, and if you'd like to take the maze for another spin, just hail the rescue services on your phone. Our whiskered wingman will reset things. You can refuel, regroup, restart the maze. Now, what's in your flight plan? Um, since I've seen before you open the series, do you think it's a chance to remake? No, I don't, old classic. I really don't think there's ever going to be a remake of them officially. Time to head home. We'll make sure all your things are back in your pockets once we landed on Hills Farm. However, any bell vouchers you might have acquired here will wind up in your mailbox shortly. And that wraps it up. Ready to take off? Totally am. There's no coming back to this Mayday tour. Ready to go? Yup. Roger. Lifting off November Oscar Whisker. I, I don't really think there's a huge amount of uh, desire for it to happen. Like, the, the Ultima fan base is not a very big one. As sad as it is. Also, we're back with all our stuff now. Got everything. Celia should be standing up in about 10 or so minutes. And... Here we are. 
Uh, I'm going to throw away this uh, flower. I don't need it. Mm, I could. Remake for the pie factory. No, we don't want that. Mayhem. Yippee! Also, there is Doze143 there, subbing with 24 months. That is two years. Thank you so, so very much. That is so absurdly kind of you. Thank you. It truly, truly is kind of you. Really is kind. Thank you. You may not think it means much, but it really does mean a lot. Also, we're buying some things. <laughs> In Ultima Runes of Virtue 2? Yes, I do. I want to go back to making pie. Yeah, that was, a, that was an experience. No, Carl, I just put down a steamroller. Yeah. Yeah. Kyle being Kyle. There are a lot of quotes about Animal Code. A lot of quote about, quotes about... We're over a hundred quotes now. I never thought we would ever be at a hundred quotes. I never thought we'd be at a hundred quotes. And yet we are. There we go. That'll net us that. And then... <laughs> a quotable person. I don't know about that. And then we have chop wood. Pretty sure I can chop wood. One of the things I'm pretty good at doing. Did you see the ult? Uh, I, I did. I see it. I bought it. I bought the ultra deluxe edition of the Stanley Parable. You know, but it has an achievement that is like super go outside, where you're not allowed to play the Stanley Parable for ten years. I have not really played, or I in fact replaced not really with. I haven't played Phasmophobia, so, uh, I'll have to take your word for it. There we go. Grab that. Do that. And there we go. You know what? We've done a lot of things, and we've done it with time to spare today. Time to spare. What's Sid up to? What are you up to, buddy? We have no idea what he's up to. He's found the noodles! That's what he's found. He's found the noodles. Hey, how's it going, Rockin'? Cup noodles. Are you okay, Sandstar? Cause I heard you were seen burying some cash yesterday, Rockin'. Don't worry, I ain't gonna dig it up or nothing. I just wanna make sure you can really afford to lose the bells. No, 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 we, we, we're not gonna lose them. I know where they are. Where's Graham? I left Graham. Well, I think I see Graham. There he is. He's walking back. The Lord again. Hey, Sandstar. How you doing? Hey, weird question for you. Did you take a shower today? Sure did. Ah, I thought so. I know this is kind of weird, but you smelled amazing, so I just really wanted to know what product you use in your hair. I like how one of the options is, how dare you? Talk to the singer messing on the island. Hint, it is not KK. Ah! Jitters. I know who you... Oh, do you have, like, a sandwich? She has a sandwich. She has eaten a sandwich. Sandy, we meet again, Tootie. 
Lately, I've been working on getting better at my knitting, Tootie. I started by making a scarf for one of my favorite stuffed animals, but the thing came out too long. It just kind of piles up around her. The evil in me wants to know what happens if you choose the evil choices. Not a huge amount. I can't really upset any of the villagers by doing that. Also, I know who you mean. Best singer. Lots of the villagers like that one spot. It's a good spot. It's like the sitting tree on Avataras. The place where they all like to sit. No way! I was totally just thinking, I wish you could talk to Sandy right now! Hello! Hey there, bestie! Can you believe this biker jacket? You gave it to me and it's definitely my fave outfit right now! Yo. Oh. Hey there! What do you need? I just want to chat. Living on the island is so fab. I mean, I'm basically the queen bee, but sometimes even I get lonely. You know what helps? Pets. I love pets. They have a way of making you feel like the specialist person ever. Pets don't exactly fit the pop star lifestyle, but maybe I could get a chatty plant or something. A, a chatty plant? Yeah, do you need some minx? I want to chat. Have you heard about the new visitor at the campsite? Seems like it's all I'm hearing about lately. Whoever they are, I'm sure they already noticed a certain je ne sais quoi on Hillsfar. I love myself a little je ne sais quoi. So, what do you think of my place? Stylish, soothing, perfect, all the above, maybe? Hee <laughs> don't hold back. I want you to love it here so that you totally want to come back all the time. Eex is amazing. Also, this is one of the houses where I needed to do very little to change it to make it amazing. Hey, super good to see you. What do you need? I just want to chat one more time. I did everything I planned to today, so I plan to take it easy tomorrow. Well, you don't get to be as famous as I by lounging around. I have stuff to do. She is famous, but not for the reasons she thinks she is. Feed me. No, no. <laughs> Uh, I don't think we want a plant that does that. There's a reference for you that some people wouldn't get. Also, 42 people here. Thank you so very much. That is so kind of you. Is she a famous musician? I mean, ask anyone in the chat. Is Bella famous? Hey, how's it going? Look at sharp, kiddo. Thanks. <laughs> Oh, sorry, kiddo. I was just thinking about this weird thing I used to do when I was younger. Me and my pals invented this game where you get a regular old piece of rope and take turns jumping over it. We called it Ropey Jumpy, and I'm pretty sure we were the first ones to ever think of it. Anyhow, a lot of time Jimmy got all tangled up, and he was stuck there until March. I can't remember what month we started playing. Oh, Boris. Oh, Boris. Bella is the best musician on Hills Falls. I need to put some of this stuff away. My inventory is full of stuff. Also, if it's that pos Can you join Bella as your musician? I mean... I got maracas. And I can groove. I mean, I have the funkiest dance beats you've ever seen. I mean, check out these sick killer moves! See? Yep, oh, someone's redeemed maracas! Well, we know that- we know that means. Maraca time! See? See? Nothing says Toy Day or late April- late April more than wearing Toy Day clothing and playing with maracas. <sighs> we did it! We did. We saved Toy Day. In April. I still have so much Easter chocolate. And I'm not even... Uh, that Christmas hat doesn't say April. No! Nope. It says Toy Day, which is December. Still love the fact that Toy Day is on December the 24th. So that you can, uh... You can have Toy Day and then Christmas afterwards. It's a nice little touch. I don't know why I decided to dress like this today. Hey, Chadwick. Now watch, in 20 seconds, they're both just gonna stand up. 15 seconds now. 10.
five. Oh, a little earlier. It's so good to unexpectedly be bumping to a friend, Feathers. I've got a gift for you. For me, really? Yup, would you like... A thing? Don't you jitters? Can do! Can I go ahead and open this? Yes, you can! Oh, this is great! It's some peaches! Thanks, that's so thoughtful of you! As a thank you, please take my sprite costume! Oh! I'd have been so worried if I'd have got a second photo today. <laughs> and she just finished warning. Where has Jitters... Okay, I will gladly say hi to Jitters. I don't know where Jitters is. Is everyone in the game impressed by the peaches? Yes. They are all impressed by peaches. Aww! Oh. I need to find Jitters. Alright, Jitters is not here. This is when I walk around the entire island and I... Alright, here's a present. Let's go get that. Fun fact, I don't like peaches. <laughs> nope. Where is Jitters? There's Graham. Hey, buddy. Ooh, Ladybug. Giles there with 24 months on a 22 month streak. That is two years. Thank you so, so very much. That is so absurdly kind of you. Thank you. Truly, that is so kind. You're all so kind. So absurdly generous. Right, I need to find Jitters. Did you just go over here? Well, Fuchsia's in. I mean, there's no requirement of the stream for, for a hype train to happen. It's awesome when they do, but... Uh, I never want to strong arm people into doing anything like that. You don't need much convincing. No, not usually. Happens more on a Monday, Wednesday, Friday stream than a uh, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday one. But they do sometimes happen on the uh, Animal Crossing streams. They do. Sometimes. Where's Jitters? Where is Jitters? Has he gone up to the top area? He might have gone up to the top area. Jitters! Someone redeemed a chat with you! Why does he go jitters? No, he's just called jitters. I don't know. Just called jitters. Maybe it's a joke on that. I don't know. Hmm. Okay, no jitters here either. Huh. There he is! Oh, how you doing, Bazirit? How you doing, buddy? You hear that KK is going to be playing a show over by Resident Services? Don't miss it! KK shreds on guitar, his abs are shredded, and he does it without all that a shred of clothing! Um, what's going on, Bazirit? Celia, can do. I'm looking for a ladybug, but no luck yet. Hang on, what? You got a ladybug? You gotta make a deal with me, Sandy. How about 400 bells? Nah, I'm not selling it, buddy. I see. If it's no deal, it's no deal. I'll take it like a pro, Bazirt. I'm not giving you my, my bug. What's up, Bazirt? 
Two more chats. Butterflies fly because they have strong arms. And also wings. Butterflies are also the most beautiful creatures ever. If I made my own butterfly wings, maybe I'd get stronger arms. And be beautiful. Listen, Sandy, can you get me a butterfly? Any kind will do. I just need to just need to be a butterfly. No. no, no. Okay, you've got a workout regime to keep up. And your muscles tone more important than my problem. <gasps> Yo, what's up, Berserk? Just one more chat. When the weather is nice like this, it really makes you want to do some rock climbing, Berserk. Well, I guess as long as it, I get some exercise, any sport's fine, really. Oh, Let me get a picture of him. Need to get a picture of him. Perfect picture. I generally don't give the villagers like items like that. They have a tendency to put them in their houses. Beep. We just keep running into each other today, Feathers. Hey, Celia. I wonder why someone left the tiki torch out. I kind of like it, Feathers. Well, I put it there so we could see. How can I help you, Feathers? You look so cute today, Sandstar. You're like a character out of this coffee shop fanfic I've been reading in your holiday sweater. I might have a hard time not picturing you as that character with the rest of the fic, Feathers. Oh! We need to know about this fic. What's up, Feathers? Let me ask you this. What kind of book would you like to have with you on a deserted island? Definitely a mystery. Excellent and appropriate choice. And there are so many mystery books set on deserted islands after all. Ooh, how exhilarating would it be to read a mystery about a deserted island on a deserted island? And by exhilarating, I mean terrifying feathers. I like the way you think. Bit. Bit. Double sit. The legendary double bear. Margie and Celia sitting together. And thus Kiko was slain. And we were titled How to Escape a Deserted Island. Fun fact, uh, we have a uh, radio show here called Desert Island Discs. And one of the things they do on it is uh, they talk about like the person's life that's on there, the guest, and like seven or so songs that they would take with them on a deserted island and they are given uh, as well as uh, those songs they're given um, the complete works of William Shakespeare uh, religious text and any one book of their choice and one luxury and some people have picked some strange choices for uh, luxuries time to get swole I think we have time for that before we conclude it's something interesting. I've never, I've not listened to it much recently because I don't do that much driving right now because of my job. But uh, still, it asks a curious question of like, what would you have with you? What would you have with you? I mean, that would only last you last you so long. Trading is the thing. And there's Jitters doing the exercising. Margie just decided today's a good day to sit. I mean, it looks lovely. True, but there are some books that would give you more fuel, as, as it were. I mean, I'd cheat. I'd probably get one of those, like, uh, anthology collection books. Maybe the Lord of the Rings trilogy, the whole thing, the, the the version that I've got, which has like the appendix and everything, that'd be a big beefy book. And they let it because you know it, it's a single book; it's just a really big book. Oh, Jidis is out of time. Ah, he's caught up now. Caught up, buddy. I 
think once I'm done with this stream, I'm definitely going to load up Avatarus and, uh, and do, um, ooh, there's one with the Hobbit as well. I totally probably get that one. Imagine getting stuck with a phone book. I mean, there was a movie where there was an ironic twist at the end with that. If you remember. He kept that package nice and safe and secure the whole time. He kept him going, wanted to deliver that package. And what was in it? A satellite phone. Could he use the satellite phone to ring for help? I was like, oh well, one of those things. Also, by doing this. We cleared that. Um, yeah, quite a lot of phones actually do start with some charge. Uh, and those kind of phones tend to have ways to, like, self-charge them. So it could have had, like, solar panels or some such. Or they would have had, like, a separate battery. The joke was that it was a phone, though. That was the joke. I mean, nowadays, it would be a lot more difficult for that to happen. Still could happen, though. Oh, I do like this song. It's a good song. You know what time is fast approaching, though, folks. You know what time is fast approaching. Let me just, uh... Get that. Well, apart from dance time. We all know dance time is here. Hmm. Time for the normal room? Yeah, time for the perfectly ordinary room! I mean... Why else wouldn't... It's Juneven time. What is this Juneven time you are referring to? It is time for me... I had to figure out... Um... Uh, <laughs> it's time for me to thank you all for being here, because seriously, these streams whiz by super, super quick. They truly do. Like, two hours goes by so fast. And there are a couple of things, of course, I would like to talk to you about before we conclude in brief. First off, there is my writing that you can check out at that link there. There is my story up there, Errant Hope, and places where you can check out links to buy my book. There's also my Discord, where you can join a large thriving community that I'm typically a part of. There's tons of emotes based on Let's Plays and streams past and present, loads of places to talk about things, and if you link your Twitch and Discord together and you're sub to me on Twitch, you can use the Twitch emotes on Discord. And no problem, Derpy! There's also my Patreon, where you can pledge to support me in doing what I do. There are no Let's Plays or streams hidden behind paywalls, but this is my full-time job, and there is a lot of stuff that goes on behind the scenes that you typically don't see, including the editing and compression of Let's Play videos, the uploading of said videos, and the writing of video and playlist descriptions, comment moderation, test recordings and test streams, troubleshooting for when things inevitably go wrong, and all the stuff that went to the background to make the uh, publication of Errant Hope that absolutely fantastic and amazing that it is. Those who do pledge to me not only get a different coloured name on Discord, and my deep and sincere thanks, they also get the ability to vote on upcoming playthroughs when the opportunity arises, like the vote that ended yesterday for the new LP to replace Wonder Song. There's also my YouTube, where you can check out all my content from the very first video I put up over 14 years ago to the most recent video I put up today and everything in between. There's also all of my Twitch VODs there, so there's over 10,000 videos from Three in 300 plus playlists, there is a lot of content. There's stuff for almost everyone. Unless you, like, do we have to wait to find out who won? Uh, yes. It'll be a secret. It'll be a secret. You won't be waiting that long, though. Um, if we get to 100,000 YouTube subscribers, by the way, I'll do a replay of Terror from the Deep and a replay stream of Wisdom Warriors 2 Iron Sword. And if we get to 550 Twitch sub points, we're at 301 right now, I will do a playthrough of Super Mario World, a game I have never played before. 
and now we're connecting to the internet. There's also my Twitter, where you can follow me to get notifications about when I start streaming, when my Let's Play videos go live, and all kinds of random other stuff, including Animal Crossing tweets, stuff where I talk about terrible marketing emails I get and poke fun at them, and also things when I talk about me writing for my book. My sequel book. I might be personally surprised. Well, I hope you will be surprised. There's also me thanking one of you, because seriously, you are all absolutely fantastic, and I do mean that. I I know I say it every single uh, stream ending, but I mean it. I absolutely mean it. You are all amazing and wonderful in your support of me, and I couldn't ask for a better community. Well, I could, but that would be really silly, because I have the best community ever. Like, you're all so supportive and kind, and I could never have imagined when I started doing this all those years ago, making Let's Play videos, that it would not only be my full-time job, supported by all of you, but that you'd all still appreciate it. And to be honest, all I ever wanted to do was, you know, make stuff that people enjoyed and uh, found entertaining, and, you know, show people games they'd never seen before, and I hope to continue to do this for many, many more years to come, because seriously, you are all worth making this content for. You are all fantastic and amazing, and I'm just so happy to have you all here. So thank you all so, so very much. Seriously, thank you, all of you. And whether it be morning, afternoon, or evening, I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day, and I hope you achieve everything you set out to do. The next stream is on Monday. That is at... 7 p.m. BST. It's going to be Streets of Rogue, and I promised I'd do an alien run, and I'm going to do an alien run, and we'll see how terribly I do with a person that can't actually fight. This will be intriguing. You dropped in too late? Well, glad to see you even if you're here at the very, very end. And no problem, Sonya. Glad to entertain you all. And so, I'll catch you next time, folks, and I'll see you then later. And remember, be nice to each other everyone, for if everyone is nice to each other, the world would be that much better a place. And we all want that, don't we? I certainly do. And I hope you do too. Later, Casey Run did. Let's hope the alien run does uh, just as well. Later.